The goal of this video is to demonstrate how to move an object in Unity using the transform.translate functionality. So this functionality is most useful for when movement should be in a local space via setting uh, the relative to to space.self, which I'll demonstrate shortly. So to start out, I'm gonna set up a very basic scene in Unity by creating a cube and then flatten it out to be the ground. So I'll set it to zero, zero, zero on the position and then 20.1 and 20 on the scale. Then I'll add a material, create another object. I'll actually create a cylinder, move that. Actually note that the camera and the cylinder are in the same orientation. So for example, the blue arrow for both are facing the same way. Uh, I'm actually going to modify the scale slightly and then add a material. Then I'm gonna create a C-sharp script. I actually already made one. I'll delete the start function and then there's actually no variables required for this. I'm just going to create two lines of code, transform.translate vector3.forward times time.delta time, and then transform.translate vector3.up dot time.delta time. And then there's going to be two options for relative to one is space.self, which applies the transformation relative to the local coordinates, or space.world, which applies the transform relative to the world coordinates. So for this, I'm actually gonna set it to space.self. And then you'll note when I save this and go back to Unity, I'll need to I believe drag the script onto the object. When I hit play, without pressing any buttons or any keys, the object's just going to go forward and up simultaneously. And that's it.